I was in first grade, I had to research a famous American. At first I chose Grace Hopper because we had the same first name, and I thought that was cool. But as I got to learn more about her, I realized that she is a real American hero. Grace Hopper was born in New York on December 9, 1906. As a child, she loved math and science and was curious about how things around her like alarm clocks worked. Grace entered Vassar College to major in her math and physics, then got her master's and PhD at Yale by 1934. She was a math teacher at Vassar College when she married Vincent Hopper. When the United States entered World War II, Grace Hopper tried to join but was turned away because she was a woman, too old and way too little. That's not fair. But in 1943, the Navy started to accept women to serve at home so the men could serve at sea. In the Navy, Grace helped compute firing tables for naval weapons. During and after the war, Grace worked with the first electromechanical computers at Harvard University. She was the third person and the first woman to program the Mark I computer in, in 1944. She also wrote a book to help others run the computer. She even introduced the idea of debugging software. When Grace was 79, she retired as a rear admiral from the Navy. She got many awards and honors, including the National Medal of Technology and the Presidential Medal of Freedom. Buildings have been dedicated to her, and in 1996, the USS Hopper was commissioned and nicknamed Amazing Grace. Grace Hopper died on January 1st, 1992. At the age of 85, she was buried in the Arlington National Cemetery with full military honors. Grace Hopper was amazing and we continue to honor her today. Thank you.